sorry, this is actually my second time recording this video because I recorded it the first time thinking that this like whole thing was supposed to be like some sort of way for simmers to put in like their content requests. But then I actually read like the forum post and it says this is not a place for content requests. And I was like, yeah, I absolutely cannot post this video because then the Sims team is going to come after me for sending people over to the forums to request new content for the game. So I'm going to re-record this now with a different approach. The Sims team made an official tweet at 2 p.m. today. It's about 45 minutes ago. They tweet Soul Soul Simmers tomorrow, May 6th, starting at 6 a.m. Pacific Standard Time. That's 9 a.m. Eastern. You can tell us what's on your mind on the Sims forums for 24 hours. Follow the positive play guidelines and share what you want us to talk about in the next Inside Max's live stream. So after reading this, the first thing that came to my mind was, oh my gosh, this is a chance for us to actually speak up about what we want to see in the game, you know? For people that want more cults, they can ask for our cults. For those of us that want improved babies, we can ask for that. For those that want cars, then even that can be talked about. But it appears as though this is actually a little bit different. That's not what this is saying at all. They have provided a link to the official forum post where they write, Soul Soul Simmers, what's on your mind for the next Sims 411? What do you want us to talk about in the next Sims 411? We'd like to know what's on your mind when it comes to the Sims, what topics you're interested in, what your concerns are, and what you'd like to chat about with us. Okay, so what exactly is this about? Is this about concerns for game features or how the game is running? I'm kind of confused as to what exactly we're allowed to ask or talk about and what we're not allowed to talk about. Because right here down below, they put, we appreciate your understanding that this is not a wish list for content requests, but a place where we can listen to your thoughts without distraction. So our thoughts about what exactly? Our thoughts about potential future content? Our thoughts about how the game is completely unstable and unplayable for many players and has been for several years? But judging by the third bullet point, this is not a place to report bugs, but please continue to report bugs on Answers HQ. Then that makes me think, oh wait, well, we can't talk about that either then. So what kind of thoughts are they interested in? Are these just like random thoughts about the game that have nothing to do with fixing the issues or adding new content? I'm just so confused as it seems like there's like really not much that they're gonna be able to talk about with us anyway. I don't know. But they continue on May 6th, starting at 6 a.m. Pacific time, that's 9 a.m. Eastern, we'll be welcoming your comments during 24 hours in the Sims forums. We'll close the conversation after 24 hours and you'll be able to share any additional comments next time. Our team is made of humans and there's only so many comments one human can read at a time. Closer to the date, we'll share the link to the forum thread again for The Sims Twitter account and on The Sims forums. So of course, like I read a minute ago, they said this is not a place for content requests, but a place where we can listen to your thoughts without distraction. This is not a guarantee we'll provide an answer in the next Sims 411, but rest assured that your comment is being read and will be addressed whenever possible. And lastly, this is not a place to report bugs, you can do so on Answers HQ. During the last part, they have the golden rule with guidelines and rules to follow and posting on the forums. Of course, be respectful, keep it game related and on topic. As we said before, this is not the place to post a wish list and bugs or talk about those Sims 4 mods that you found. So what can we talk about that? It's just like, I don't know, I'm just kind of confused. Like, it just seems like there's just a big gray area here. Would improved babies count? I mean, it's not like a pack it's just something that i feel like many simmers want to see improved in this game because babies should not be objects seven years after base game release you know but i feel like in a way that could fall under content requests so they probably won't talk about it or answer it but at the same time they say you know this is a place where we can listen to your thoughts well that's the thought that i had in my mind you know i don't know i'm just so confused about this i feel like they could have definitely been a little more specific i feel like they're just a little too vague here don't make things personal. It's not cool to target other players who may have different opinions or attack sim gurus and other officials. This also means please no mass taggings. Don't bully, troll, bait, or derail the conversation. And don't spam or flood this thread. I don't know. I'm kind of confused about this. Share below exactly what you think that they're wanting to hear from us or wanting to discuss. I don't know. I'm just kind of confused about this a little bit. I'm in a way a little disappointed because I really thought that this was going to be a way for players to really 
really like get their concerns out there about you know future content and why certain things haven't been fixed and why the game is still almost unplayable for a lot of simmers but it doesn't seem like they're really going to be talking about that too much but i definitely recommend that you take advantage of this it's happening tomorrow i wanted to make a video on this just to remind you in case you did not participate in the last live stream that the sims team hosted i love you guys so very much thank you for clicking and watching and i'll see you all next time so long happy simming bye everyone